my friends saw fit to warn me that when I named this company Unaliware, it meant I was always going to be last. But here I am. I'm Jean Ann Booth, CEO and founder of Unaliware. And after my previous startup companies sold to Texas Instruments and Apple, I came out of retirement to start Unaliware because my mom was turning 80 and she wasn't willing to wear today's emergency alert products because they're ugly, limited to use in the home and less tethered to a smartphone, and that big help button is socially stigmatizing. My mom is one of the 88% of the independent living population above the age of 75 who simply refuses to use today's emergency alert products. Amen. Amen. <laughs> so our mission, our moonshot, is to extend independence with dignity for millions of vulnerable people, starting with my mom. I've assembled a dream team of um, executors to create independence with dignity, to deliver independence with dignity, and I've already told you a little bit about my background as a serial entrepreneur. In my co-founders, some of them have been with me for more than 15 years through multiple companies, multiple successful exits. And we have a secret weapon, too. On our board of directors is a guy named Bill Lyon. Bill's got 30 years' experience in the personal emergency response system market. He was number two at Lifeline before the Philips acquisition for $650 million. He was number two at Visonic before the acquisition by Tyco. And he's worked at LifeStation, Essence, and Numera. Because of our dream team, that's why we are where we are today. Now, it was first the focus groups who called our Canega watch a wearable on-star for people because we provide discrete support for falls, medication reminders, and a guard against wandering with Guide Me Home Assistance using an easy speech interface rather than buttons. You don't need a smartphone because it's actually built into the watch. The easiest way to see how it is that we're different than everybody else is to answer the question I get most often. Jean Ann, why don't you just use an Apple Watch or a Samsung Gear? <laughs> Here's why. Number one cause of injury death among seniors is falls. Majority of falls happen in the bathroom. Majority of falls in the bathroom happen at night when your Apple Watch or your Samsung Gear is charging. It was our patent pending quick swap battery system in the band that means you never have to take your watch off to charge that made me come out of retirement to extend independence with dignity for my mom. On top of that, we deliver the only predictive preemptive support using artificial intelligence that learns the wearer's lifestyle. So think of it like a Nest thermostat, except for people. In the last eight months, we've, we have been running a user experience test with 150 people all across the US, ranging in age from 23 to 97, and encompassing seniors, people with MS, Lou Gehrig's, Parkinson's, epilepsy, Down syndrome, blind people, and disabled vets. So they're all independent but vulnerable population. These testers have done over 650,000 hours of testing, and they've made over 8,000 voice calls on a Canega watch. We received final regulatory approval October 26th of 2017, and we are selling B2B2C through the traditional channel, which is actually the medical alarm call centers. We're up and running in three of the largest medical alarm call centers in the US, and we are sold out of product. October 26th, I'm sold out. So I started the company actually to deliver independence with dignity for my mom. And then I realized how much the Canega watch and service could help and make a difference for independent but vulnerable populations like my mom. I'm hoping that you're going to join us as we extend independence with dignity for millions of vulnerable people. Fred Astaire, what time is it? The time is 10.19 a.m. You know only wears Canega watch and service is the friend who talks to you. Thank you. <laughs>